This time I'll be I'll, I will be working on the process for uh, the first page of my second comic, uh, Horror Stories. My first comic, it's uh, already done. I've been working a lot of time um, um, the last uh, two months, and it's already done. I am working on the legal stuff and uh, supplier for printing, but this time it's for my, um, uh, my series of horror stories. And this will be the, the process for the first uh, page. Uh, so I'll be I will be talking a, a little bit about the process I made for for this uh, first page. Are uh, you right? You if you are not familiar with the process for illustration in comic books or general comics, you will see that in everything obviously start with a uh, sketch or the concept. <clears throat> As you can see, it's um, the composition for the girl on the left and the scenario and the mysterious thing. Later you will, you will be working on the, on, the, on the line and the clean line, which will be some kind of digital ink. Uh, it will be something similar as, as if you work on paper. Sometimes I do a, a little second process to see how will be the lightning, and that helps a lot. Uh, previously, when you uh, put the color for the final stage and uh, the text and legal stuff. So yeah, uh, this will be something similar, but this is the page I am working on. I already finished it and put the color. So in this video, you will see part of the process for the clean line, as I call it, uh, which be which will will be something again similar to the the digital ink. As you can see, uh, the girl is already uh, with the color and shadows and everything else. So here, what I'm what I'm making it's uh, working on the on a second layer for only a specific. The, the line. Sometimes, I mean, uh, 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 some people thank you for the approaching. Ask me uh, how tools I use. Um, uh, by now, they are the, the tools we use on digital ink uh, are pretty common and as well now. But if you know, if you don't know, uh, what I use is a Cintiq, the Let's say the the personal. Uh, it's uh, the small one, the thirteen inches, I think. Yeah. Uh, the Cintiq. It's a. Um, it's a tablet, but it's a the the screen series, which will be you 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 are uh, working right directly you know, on the on the on the screen. Uh, the Cintiq, it's by Wacom. And you you need your, your Cintiq, your wires, which is included. You can search for it. And obviously a digital pen. The software is uh, just Photoshop in this case. And uh, the pencil is uh, the basic one. I just put um, the, 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 the size I need. And the pressure with the pencil will make you mm, the rest. So in here, I will try to to follow all the the previous material I've been working on uh, on the sketch, and I try to mm, to follow the the exact shapes and figures and, and and lines just to to make it right exactly where where the illustration it is. Um, here I'm trying to make a little texture to simulate the the uh, the texture of the of the material which will be some kind of uh, steel let's say for the for the shower and I try to emulate the full process, the, the full process as if I was uh, working on regular or 
mm, real paper uh, in comics. Uh, when they started uh, at the what we or at, at least at, at least what I um, knew from the artists I I admire. They start with the pencil. Sometimes the, the same person is the, the person who inks the pencils. But most of the time, those days, uh, there was another person who made the, the ink. So there was the pencils, the ink, another person with the color, uh, and finally uh, another person with the text. And maybe... The, the last person will be the, the person who who works to make the file for printing, which uh, at the time was a completely different uh, approach as we know today, because obviously t technology uh, went really different to those days. Now, uh, almost uh, anyone can work the full process in their own style, in their own quality. Um, obviously, there are a lot of styles, qualities, and I don't know, levels of perfection and, and details. Here, I'm trying to, to, to again, to, to leave exactly the, the, the same line, uh, which is in the, in the layer behind. I just put some level, some kind of uh, transparency. Uh, I usually, I don't know, uh, use for the sketch. Once when I when I did the sketch, I leave it in a second layer, maybe at thirty or fourteen percent of transparency. And on the second layer, which I am working right now, uh, I leave it on one hundred percent, and I just work with the. Again, with the regular and basic pencil. If you are not familiar with a Cintiq, obviously that it's not uh, a, um, I don't know, let's say a problem or something. You can work on paper as the same as you are watching right now. You, you just need maybe some kind of uh, different materials you work in in one kind of uh, paper for your for your pencil and maybe you can use some uh, thin paper on the top when you are inking with with ink maybe pencils or maybe some kind of brush stuff like that but if you can afford let's say some wacom tablet in the beginning, I use um, well. I can. I will share some of the tools um, I use in, in 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 my early days from digital uh, illustration. Obviously, this is not sponsored by any brand. I will talk about. Hopefully, in the future will be. But in the beginning, I my first tablet was uh, the Genius. You can search for it. It's um, it's gone, it's no longer on the market, but it was the Genius um, pen. It was a little big, the surface. The, the pencil they use um, used to, to need uh, uh, batteries like AA. Um, and I use, uh, I think, two of them because they were, uh, they were pretty cheap at that time. Even when they were special tools for digital, they were not that expensive. But not much uh, with quality. The pressure, the pressure was the the minimum you will require for stuff like this. So I use two of them because I broke it and. I don't know, maybe I'm kind of radioactive or, or something because I broke the stuff with my, uh, with the use I, I gave him. So I use the two, two of the gray model. Later, they upgraded with some 
a little smaller, which was uh, 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 a little upgrade, I think, pretty good. But as well, they were not um, that, um, let's say, uh, resistant to the, to the use. So I broke the pen, and I again, I think I use two of them. Later, I I can I bought the the I think it was the name Bamboo the the tablet Wacom the 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 smallest they have at that time. And it was pretty good. The the pressure was again the the minimum for you to use um, this kind of illustrations. And I really love it because it was um, really small, and it was completely perfect for for the things I I really needed. And after the the Wacom bamboo, I bought the again again uh, another Wacom. Really small again. They call it uh, the sketch model. It was really. Uh, I think that was the 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 best design. I like it more, even from the new ones. At that time, Wacom uh, release, and they have the same kind of tablets. Um, just a tablet, not a monitor, like the Cintiq. No, just say the tablets. But they were really small, really big, and they were really, really expensive. Uh, but for some reason, I didn't like it because in, in some studio I was uh, working, they 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 bought some of them. They were really big. You can program some area area you you want to work, even if it was uh, the full area from the tablet or just some. Uh, I don't know some corner for your preference for working, but they they were really big and for me as I try to work and I like to work as freelance and 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 bring some of some of my stuff for this office and for the for the place I work etc. The tablets were really big, so the small one uh, it was really good. When I bought the the that. Um, small sketch one tablet by Wacom at that time they some places they receive your previous tablet and they can I don't know take it as a, some kind of advance for the new one you you bought with them so I changed my my bamboo for the new one and the troubles started because at that time Wacom started to release uh, uh, more frequently uh, the new ones so uh, again the 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 control the 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 yes the application and the upgrades uh, 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 digital start to f to fail at some point so uh, i don't have uh, at that time another alternative so i need to bought a new one when i when the when my tablet start to fail and the new designs, I I don't like it. I actually start. Uh, I still have and is the one with I am working. If not, if I am not working in, on my synthetic, I work with the with the bamboo. I think this one is just call it small one. Yeah, it's the small. And because I have those at that time, um, I give them again as an advance. And I bought a second one, which I still have it for, I don't know, for some uh, mm, uh, some backup, let's say. Uh, the, the sketch one, but the designs, I don't really like it. Uh, those uh, round stuff everywhere, I think they look like like toys for, for kids or something, but they are the best tools I, I have for, for digital. So all of these are just tablets, um, or just all the, the, the materials I've been working are tablets. And you can do exactly what I am doing here. As you can see, I'm trying to, again, to, to leave the, 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 every line on the same uh, kind of uh, uh, thickness of the stroke uh, as the sketch. The, the challenge for the long lines, it's, um, 
to try to leave them exactly where the where the concept art and i think i am trying to i am really mm, doing my best for for that for that matter uh later that this same studio they bought the some syntax the, the 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 biggest that, that was at that time i think they are 24 inches but they were huge really really heavy the the base was some kind of uh i don't know it was really heavy you can lift it with by one person but at that time sometimes the persons i i work i work uh with some co-workers and really i i like to to call them some some of them is the uh, friends and they prefer to to lift them by by two two co-workers to two persons because they they were really they were really big and right now that same model it's um it's lighter it's um mm, uh thinner and obviously uh, more more precisely and because of the, the technology you know it's it really really um different from like 10 years ago five years ago so I work on on the 24 inches and it was really good experience. But if you ask me, I prefer night and date uh, every day of the week, my 13 inches um, Cintiq, the small one, because uh, it's for me, it's better to work on on that size. Even uh, I can use, you can use uh, your synthetic for not for not only for digital illustration but um, 3D modeling as well. When I am working on ZBrush, uh, I use um, uh, actually on ZBrush I use um, most of the time my my little Wacom tablet. But um, for little textures or or special things, I use also my synthetic because it's. Um, you can work directly on the, on the screen again and you have some kind of different control from from your tablet and if you don't know the tablet um, hope you can you already search for it so you can know what i'm talking about uh, when you are working on tablets you are watching your screen when i was um, when i was working on on, on my stuff uh, when I was working on my stuff, some some of them asked me like, "Hey, what is what is what is this? What is that?" And I invite them to hey try it out, and I give them my my pen, and but they look at the at the tablet, but they don't watch the screen, so they don't know what is happening on on, on the screen, what what are they were um, drawing on on the tablet. So when they work on the tablets, you are not watching. Uh, your tablet you are watching your screen and, and you're drawing on, on your tablet and the big difference from async is that you are uh, drawing on the table uh, but it's uh, at the same time the screen you are uh, drawing directly so it's it's really really good it's what i am doing right here sometimes i use uh, most of the time and all the time i am uh, rotating my 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 canvas so the core but the the curve you are trying to approach it will be better when when you are uh, making some curve from the hips uh, where where i am working and the the longest part which obviously are most of the time the legs uh, which you want to 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 leave them really with with delicacy and uh, they they have to look really pretty or the the arms um, maybe and the the back of her as well because it's obviously the the, the part which it's more uh, important at this time mm. uh, but yeah those are the tools um the tablets and the the, the monitors, uh, everyone except the the first one, all of them 
I was working with um, with Wacom, and the first one were were Genius. Again, Genius is no longer available. They um, they went out from the market, and at uh, this moment, they are there are so, there's a lot of another brand which is. Uh, Is taking uh, a good, um, let's say, uh, part of the market from the artists. I think I I I saw some reviews of the. Uh, I can't remember the name of the brand, but you will find it. Is the the most the second most uh, known brand from this kind of tools. That's from the software. And none of them, um, in none of them, in, in neither of them, I use the software they use. And this part, as you can see, is one of the, the challenges because the line is have to, it, it needs to be really uh, soft and bold, let's say, because of the shape of, of the girl. But... Yes, I, I am trying to, to emulate exactly the, the line and I am really uh, take care of, of, the, of this figure, right? So the software was, um, the hardware, I, I'm sorry, the, the, the hardware is um, the tablet and the Cintiq. And the software, if you mm, download the, the software, maybe they were some sketchy software um wacom also has this um something similar from the Cintiq, but it's another name which it's it's it has his his own uh, uh, cpu and and memory and programs you can install uh, let's say photoshop in the in the tablet and the monitor and you can work with that and it has its own uh, hard drive and space for for you to save your documents but as you are uh, imagining uh, it will be mm, i don't know i i don't use that and i don't think i will be interested in that because it, you will need you will need to have uh, to deal with upgrades and uh this has to be compatible or I don't know, I think I think I'd rather uh, use the Cintiq and leave and leave all the uh, memory and processor and hard drive and all of all of that to my Mac. Right? So the software it will be only Photoshop for this time. And uh, sometimes for maybe for the text and, and typography and all of the extra elements, I will use Illustrator. So, yeah, that, I think that's uh, most of the thing I use. Um, and here, let's, I will talk a little bit uh, about my comic. I really like uh, the uh, scary uh stories when there is this ghost and this will be some kind of final girl um the girl will be uh like uh, some something will be haunting her on on her apartment and i am really fan of those uh, classic horror movies which where the the girl is this um, beautiful beautiful girl um with with the long hair and and an amazing body a uh, body and so i'll try to to get inspired for some stories and i don't know some haunting evil stuff so here let's put some details so here the girl will be obviously you are watching she's uh, taking a shower and um, she will be hearing some noise on some 
another area of her apartment. But I tried to 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 put some uh, some kind of uh, mood. Uh, she maybe came back from her work after a long day. So she was taking a hot shower, feeling really good. After this long day, maybe I think she's uh, she's single uh, because she's um, by herself, feeling really good, uh, enjoying herself at this moment. And yes, um, later she she will be hearing this noise, uh, which with uh, which uh, made her stop the, the the shower and 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 go go outside. Right here, I'm working on 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 the water, and some sometimes the the little things are really tricky because maybe uh, you are working a little faster. Uh, but also they need the same uh, the same detail to so you can leave them uh, the same as the same from from the sketch and uh, one thing this was a life i made uh, a couple of i think weeks ago mm, i don't know i think yeah i think they were a couple of weeks ago so you can follow my social medias my social media i'm sorry uh, my pages um, where i used to um, sometimes make lives from illustration it's on on instagram which is the same you are watching on the bottom of of the left of this video you can follow i will appreciate if you can follow and maybe share uh, this um, this video from 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 youtube to i don't know some of your friends for you for them to know my work and when i am finish my my comics i will um i will be some making some announcements so where you can find them maybe i think this will be only digital but the first one I, I already finished it, that will be printed and digital as well. Because that is really special. It's, um, I don't know, uh, some, it's special to me and, and I really like the story. I love those characters I made. So that's why that will be printed and Again, I think that will be again as digital. So uh, maybe next year I will be releasing. At this moment, we are on the end of the year of um, 2023. 20, uh, so in 24, I will be making some announcement for, for where you can find it. Here, these are, these are the, the previous process. This is our, these are like the, the, the raw sketch and the sketch. And I am trying to 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 look at them so I can leave the the same expression because I really like it. I think she's uh, uh, feeling really good. Uh, finally, this little moment to me and uh, a hot water, water hot shower. Um, and yes, I, I sometimes I I need to to look off at my my concept because the the layer behind my my line it has some transparency so the right uh, i am looking at the the same uh, the same layer but but with the 100 percent transparency so i can see that is the same the same expression because i think in comics you 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 are talking um, about telling the story and and making some emotion from the, from the characters so i need to leave them right exactly where 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 i am where i uh 
what I did on, on the on the previous process, which is the sketch. So as you can see in the right side, there are three panels, only three panels on this um, on this page. The first one is when she's um, uh, taking the shower. And the second one is say uh, she heard the noise and she um, closed the, the 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 water. And the third the third one it's uh, she's like going outside the the bathroom to see what what is happening uh, from the shower. And here uh, it's uh, I'm working on the on the theme. You are maybe watching a, a, a little subliminal, maybe some steam monster. And yes, my the stories uh, again. I am I am trying to make this collection from horror stories, so you can uh, expect uh, more of this. I think this this uh, little um, stories will be like shorter. Uh, for because I I want to share a lot of stories I have in mind. This one will be this girl, which is uh, uh, there are some haunting entity on on her apartment, and I like the end. Uh, uh, and yes, they will be shorter than than the one that I am printing about. I hopefully I I will be looking for May the second. The second uh, chapter for for the the printing one, uh, and yes, I will announce. We will be announcing where you can find them. So here again, I am trying to 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 reach the 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 minimum details for each area uh, in, in the girl in in every line here. It's at least in this panel. It's a pretty important uh, part. I like to think uh, uh, of her as this girl from eighty movies, uh, uh, horror movies, monster movies, and stuff like that. I think I will be working on on horror and dark stories. So. Yes, I think they will be they will be good. Maybe if I may, uh, if I do um, a lot of them, maybe I will be this collection so I can be able to print it. But it's um well, it's not that easy because obviously every everything it's about uh, cost and money and time. And printing a book, it's not that easy, uh, but hopefully I, I can be able to, to print the, the first one of my other first comic that I already finished. So this is the second one, uh, but also the first one on these horror stories. My first one is a, like a, a romance a comic um funny story mm. it will be also like drama um, but most of the time i trying to to think on my first comic as some uh, love love story and i love the characters uh, soon i will be releasing i am very excited to to see uh, how it will be printing uh, this week I am trying to to reach some uh, meetings with with some suppliers to to see budgets and stuff. Um, and back to this one. This is the first page. I already have the second one with even with text. So this will be the first the first part, and you can expect the second one pretty soon because I already have the 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 capture of of the process and yes again this was a a live stream i i did on on instagram you can you can follow and some of the times i am working on 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 these pages i made these little streams and i captured these ones so later i can talk a little more on detail 
for this one. What else? Well, the, the hardware, the software, the little story, uh, my comics, this is the second one, um, the second title, the first number on this second title, the first one, it's already done. I already did, did it. Um, uh, I was uh, talking if I made this, this collection, I, I will be making a like collection of these horror stories. Um, uh, I would appreciate if you, if you like my post so I can see what, what my audience and I don't know, followers are, uh, are watching. So if you are, I don't know, maybe in, in this field, like studying arts and graphic designs, and or make your making your own stuff if you have any questions you can write on on my socials i maybe so maybe sometimes i'm not connected all the time but i uh, but i read all the comics uh, some people made on on my youtube channel or on instagram on my post or direct message message uh, yes, I try to to reply to all of them. And also, if you are some writer um, for that for some reason came here, uh, yes, I also can work for for some projects. So uh, I have uh, this um, these persons who who approach. They ask me about if I can work for some projects of them. Um, yes, what I, what would I would I need? Maybe you can. I'm sorry, I'm making some com comparisons to see that everything is the same. Yes, if uh, but if you need some illustrator, I will need um, um, a few things, obviously the time you need the, the project, how many pages, if it's only uh, the art of it's also the, the, the color and the budget. Uh, I hope you understand that we obviously do this for, for two things. The first one is that I want to tell my own stories and when, it, when I am working on some projects, uh, we need to be paid uh, fairly. But one important thing also it's uh, uh, to be really transparent and and to think as uh, real professional stuff because um, in this uh, area some uh, if you uh, search a little bit the illustrators the best way we work it's uh, by obviously with, with some uh, with some budget. But at the same time, if they talk about reprintings and stuff like that, the best thing for the artist is to get paid for, uh, have some extra for, for the printings or depending on the project. But yeah, maybe to see what is your, your, your kind of story, uh, what kind of, what amount of pages. And one important thing to me, it's uh, to be able to, to post it on on my own accounts uh, as a, a portfolio, uh, we understand that uh, one it's uh, while we are working. Obviously, it will be on uh, as a secrecy project. But once the 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 comic it's on published or or uh, printed and or released on digital uh, every artist want to share it as a portfolio to see, to, to the people to see uh, what are we able to do and on your project obviously uh, have the uh, uh, credited by the artist by the art by uh, this guy or that guy that girl the color is for this girl the color is for that guy and I, uh, I would appreciate that you understand that uh, for every project. 
Uh, but yeah, in this case, um, if that's the case, uh, I can also work on some extra projects. And for this one, this one is uh, my own project, my own story, my own char characters. And I really like to, to work on them. So I take the, the, the time, but also I try to, uh, to do it in, in the time of the industry. You will be hearing that uh, one page per day, per day. Mm, so yes, I try to do that in my comic. I I put I I was really strict on my own, uh, to with the timing and the deadline because I was trying to work as if I were hired by a, a company. I tried to reach, you know, all the editorial editorials we also know as the best one, and I don't know. So my own comic, the the one I already finished. It, I try to to keep my standards on time and quality, and I think I uh, mm, uh, I, I feel really proud because uh, my art, my style um, was uh, evolving a little bit, and for the best. I think every page I see some improvement on quality and in, in time and expressions, and I don't know. I feel really good. Obviously, compared to 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 some other artists, the art will be really different. The quality is really different because everyone everyone uh, of us has um, his own style, her own style, his own quality, her own quality. But for to me, by by this time, at this time, by right now, this is what I like. This uh, cartoony style. And some people, uh, um, uh, some people reach out and leave some comments. Hey, I like your art. Good work, and I really appreciate that. Thank you, and I really like it. I think I like I I like the the art I made for my own comics. So we are reaching out uh, to the to the end of this first part uh, for the process of the clean line or the digital ink. Again, if this was a, a regular process, um, the pencil that would be the part you are watching on some transparency of on a lower layer, and in real in real paper that would be that. Some some artists, uh, some inkers, uh, like to work on the original, depending on the on the process and the the rights for the art stuff like that. But sometimes they work on the uh, above the the pencil. When they ink it, they erase the the pencil, so the pencil no longer exists. It's something uh, interesting to to think about. Sometimes. When you see the the originals, you are only watching um, now the the final the final the final inked uh, version of the page. So, in, in, and in sometimes they used another kind of paper to put over the pencil, and so you have both of them the pencil and the inked one so you can have two of them but in this time i am working digital because i really like it uh, honestly i don't have uh, space and, and and the time maybe or the budget to to have all the materials for for physical um, illustration but if the project will require it and the budget and the price is right of course i can i can do a physical illustration and and i really like it and it it has his own feeling his own let's say finish uh, uh finishment 
and the rendering it's is completely different uh, with real pencil for for digital right there are incredible artists from of uh, for digital and for physical and my heroes will be the guys that will be I, I am following since since I am a kid uh, reading stories from from the comics I grew up and the the, the cartoons I watch the movies I watch um, I don't know and there, uh, there are incredible those uh, old school art and stuff like that but again uh, thank you for watching this um, you will be expecting you can expect the second part uh, this i am right now making my favorite part the the, the one i really liked it the most which is the nose um but yeah um i keep, um, there will be a second part please uh follow my my socials um this this is the first one the first part and really soon I will be working on the second part and the second page of my comic for horror stories. Thank you very much. I am Juan Jose and see you next time. Bye.